Hey, so I am going to be doing a video today just in regards to me coming to a bit of an end of an era. So for a while I have worn hearing aids and um, for the last couple of years I've been trialling out a cross system with a wire at the back. So from my deaf side, which is on my left, and then it, what it actually does is it takes the hearing from an aid which are wearing my right ear and then it goes across into my left side with the use of this cable at the back and it mimics me having perfect hearing um, and for a couple of years now it's been a really really great uh, service, great product for me to use and why it's so significant today is because tomorrow I am going to be starting on a new era with separate new hearing aids bit of a mixed emotion because I have never worn a hearing aid on my, which I refer to as my good side and my right ear. And tomorrow, because of some hearing changes, I believe, I'm going to have a hearing aid in either on both sides, and it's going to be something new to trial. And then on the back of that as well, I'm also going to try a system which will be called a bi cross hearing aid, I believe, um, but without the wire. So it will be fantastic. And why it's so important for me is because I've overcome so many self-confidence issues and I mean I've literally gone from going into a room and thinking everybody's looking at my hearing aids to now being able to just think to myself it's for me it really really helps me and slowly but surely I've got stronger with it and it doesn't seem to bother me as much as it did sometimes it still does and sometimes I have really difficult days of it but other times and most of the time now I'm really really good with it and it helps so much that sort of outbalances any of the image issues I used to worry about I mean goodness when I think back to when I was at school I really really worried about wearing my first hearing aid on my left side when I had a slight hearing loss and gradually as it's got worse I've now got no hearing at speech level on that side if I remember rightly which is sensory profound loss and I've got a slight hearing loss now on my right side, so things have changed quite dramatically, but I'm still fit and well and healthy, I say, as I'm literally just going in possibly for my next, my third hernia repair, but however, that's another, that's another story. But anyway, new hearing aids tomorrow. So I'm going to come back, I'm going to report via video, I reckon, what's happening and how I feel about them first thoughts, first feelings, if they're comfortable to wear, what it feels like, and we'll go from there. So just a quick review basically today. So I've got a bit of a record of what I've gone from, what I'm going over to. So it's quite crazy really. So as you can just see, I've got a hearing mold on my, what I refer to as my deaf side or my poor side. I've got a traditional looking hearing aid in a color of brown, which was originally meant to be hair color. And from here, I've got cable which comes all the way around the back of my neck to a similar type of aid but this one's only got like a, a very thin coil up inside my ear to hold it in rather than a mould and I believe tomorrow I'm going to have a mould in that ear um, and I've got the hearing aid just at the back here and uh, it served me really really well and it's probably changed my life actually. Um, we're still getting there, we're still trying new things and tomorrow I believe I'm going to be one of the first people to try this new style of hearing aid and my audiologist at uh, Yeovil Hospital, um, we're going to try out some new systems and things tomorrow so hopefully that goes really really well and I'm actually quite excited about it of course being my hearing it's a pretty huge thing and without having this wire anymore it's going to be pretty much amazing and um, it's going to boost my confidence even more and sort of self-image. I'm playing with the idea of growing out some most of the top of my hair and we're going to probably play around with some styles and things just to see if I can not necessarily cover it because I'm quite pleased now about when I say pleased I suppose I'm more comfortable about embracing my hearing problem because it's me. It's not just an issue it is part of me so I'm not going to say to cover up the hearing aids but I'm going to be much much more happier, quite excited going forward because every time I've had my hair cut I've always had it sort of arrowed to the back or tapered into the back so it's a bit of a feature so the first thing what people see when I'm at work or with family or out and about is people don't say, see sorry, my 
hearing aid wire. They see this good feature of my hair at the back and then they see my hearing aid if they have to. And it's worked pretty well from now, but now I'm ready for a new start in this chapter, new hearing aids. Hopefully it's going to be a new me. So we may play around with some hairstyles going forward as well for that. But first things first, tomorrow, new hearing aids. And I will update then. So thanks for that. And I will be updating soon, hopefully, with a new set of ears. So I'll be able to hear an awful lot better. So I'm really looking forward to that. So for now, that was it. And I'm really pleased I've done that, actually. I feel a hell of a lot lighter. So I'm really pleased I've done that. And I will be updating soon. So bye for now.